Welcome. Where do you see this beautiful home we have on Country View Court? Into the left, we have the living room. It's the colonial. This home um, brands together the old and the new. So we have a beautiful uh, marble surround fireplace. This home has, I believe, four fireplaces. So center hall colonial, recessed lighting, and beautiful hardwood floors. The beauty of this is this room opens right into a closet with custom, sorry, an office with custom built-ins. Great place for an office or your children to do homework. We've got two desk spaces and lots of lower level cabinets and upper level shelving. Continuing through the office, we take you to the first floor powder room, which was added years ago to this floor. So it has a pocket door and a very high end toilet and a nice space saving corner sink. We also have more built ins right here. Great place to keep your vacuum, your cleaning supplies and a coat closet, which is a double closet. So this is one end of the foyer and we will walk forward and show you coming in the front door because the foyer has really got that wow factor when you first come in. So she's got this beautiful antique baby bench, but you see the crown molding and the five inch um, floorboards and the chair rail, it's just stunning. These are double doors, by the way, that go into this living room with a really nice um, wrought iron fixtures. So we have more built-ins, and this is a very large, uh, long room. This room could be considered the front part, the parlor, the back part, the dining room. Uh, you could use this room for so many different ways, but could just imagine entertaining your family and friends here for holidays. So check this piece out. I'm going to spend a minute here. It's got beautiful lighted glass cabinets. It's got um, drawers, pull-out drawers, all the beautiful lighted. These are the soft clothes, all the beautiful down lights, and uh, a wine refrigerator. So this was custom made several years ago, and it's just a beautiful piece for entertaining in your home. So the back of this room has a gorgeous bay window that just brings the outside in. And come meet me in the kitchen. The kitchen is the wow factor of this house. Look at that line of windows. So to brag about the kitchen more, we've got a, um, a flat top electric cooktop there and with the pot faucet. And we've got beautiful granite countertops. We can zoom in on those. And we have um, subway tile backsplash. And check out this beautiful hood. Um, just stunning. And we've got an amazing amount of storage from drawers to cabinets. And check out the beautiful big marble farm sink. So we've got all stainless in here. We've got um, the oven right here into the cooktop, double ovens right into this oversized island, not cooktop, excuse me, and more, and more and more and more cabinets and drawers and a door to the backyard. Then we have the large Sub-Zero fridge, stainless, absolutely beautiful, with a lower freezer. And look at all this pantry space with the pull-out drawers. Just fabulous. This homeowner is very organized. Now take a moment to check out the um, reclaimed hardwood floors. This is reclaimed wood. It's just stunning. And the lower part of this great room that's directly off the kitchen has the exposed wooden beams, antique, and the antique wood that's what? A third up the wall and another huge fireplace and a gorgeous rustic mantle. And this whole area, this room is my absolutely favorite part. Check it out. From way back here, it is just stunning. 
We also have more custom cabinets to the left. And we're back into the foyer that opens up to, could be a parlor, it opens up to the massive dining room. More custom built-ins, and then the back staircase. So as we travel back through the great room, we're gonna take you into the mud room, which is super cool. Oh, did you see the beautiful pendant lights over the, and then skylights, forgot the skylights. We have four skylights here in this kitchen and cathedral ceilings. You just don't wanna leave this kitchen. Now we're gonna go upstairs in this beautiful home. Come on up. This brings you up to this really nice landing, which is all carpeted. And we'll go here to the left. We'll go right around here. See this really pretty area with storage and the dormers, it's super charming. Here's one of the bedrooms upstairs. All the bedrooms are a really nice size. They have the dormers with beautiful windows, all have overhead lighting. And nice size closet. And the closets have not necessarily been cleaned out, but we wanted to make sure you could see the size and the scope of the closet. Here it gives you a view down into the living room, and we're gonna to come to the next bedroom, bedroom number two. Another beautiful bedroom, sunny with two nice size windows. The pull down attic upstairs from this bedroom where there's storage up there. And I do believe this home has three heating zones. And this takes you to the hall bath. The hall bath which has very nice tile tub, um, a nice high vanity big mirror and um, chrome fixtures. And lastly, we have the third bedroom up here before we get to the master. That is two cute little single beds. Again, check out the beautiful hardwood flooring. And this one has a closet as well. We'll show you the closet. There you go. And we come around to the right and we come right into the master suite. And here is the master bathroom. So it's got a beautiful corner deep soaking tub with sconce lighting, a nice private area for the um, water closet, so to speak. Turn that light on. And the view is beautiful out the windows. This home is in a, on a spectacular lot as we mentioned before. And here's a really nice size frameless glass shower and a nice tall double vanity with wrought iron fixtures, a nice big mirror, and plenty of drawers, soft closed drawers, and cabinet space. Now we're entering the master suite, which is enormous as you can see. It's got a beautiful brick wood burning fireplace a closet to the right of that. I'll take you over to see that. So this room has a lot of closet space. It also has a sitting area. The um, flat screen TVs that are installed in this home will convey. And you can see this other wide open space on both sides of the king size bed. And this is a back staircase to the downstairs, conveniently comes right into the master. And then this master bedroom has a very large with container store shelving, very large um, is in her master closet. So this laundry chute comes right out to the laundry room. How great is that? Something from years ago that is uh, forgotten now in new builds and I think they should be adding them for convenience. And then off the master, you have this enormous bonus room. This is ideal for a nursery. Uh, here they're using it as a study. You could have your treadmill or your Peloton up here and have it as a little workout room, meditation room, and another closet. So there is so much storage in this home and the hardwoods and the five inch moldings at the baseboards are very um, on trend. 
Now we're going to check out the lower level. It has a really nice um, Berber carpet, very neutral, and we're going to go to the right. And you're going to find a very large, expansive rec room, again, with a wood-burning fireplace brick, lots of recessed lighting, lots of light. This is subgrade in the front, and it's a walkout basement, which is hugely popular. It also has a wet bar with a sink and another flat screen TV. And you can see there is a ton of space. And as I'm gonna show you on the other side of this room is another rec room. And this takes you to the outside. We'll just take a quick peek. So we'll pan left and pan right just so they can see. 100% privacy and absolutely beautiful. Now as we go to the left down here, you'll see more rec room space. And this could be like the game room. They used to have a pool table down here. You can see they've got basketball, sewing, and children's toys. And as we come in here and go to the right, is the fifth non-conforming bedroom. This could be fixed so you've got a window well and had the egress. It has two windows, but it doesn't um, comply to be a legal bedroom due to the height of the window. So this room has really nice carpeting and very spacious closets, which right now the family in the process of packing and moving. So the closets we're just showing so you can see the space and the size. On trend ceiling light and really beautiful, trendy, gray paint. Now we're coming to the full bath that's down here, fully renovated, absolutely gorgeous. A nice glass shower, very tall vanity um, with chrome fixtures. And um, uh, granite countertops, very, very classy. Just to give you a look, see in and around, so you see how much storage space. In these days of COVID, in case we have a sight unseen buyer, um, we can show you everything so you know what to expect. Great playroom, the kids love it down here. So right off the kitchen in the great room is a fabulous mudroom area. So we walk down a couple steps and to the left is another powder room. Isn't that beautiful? With lovely beadboard and um, a single vanity and lovely tile flooring. And then check out this mudroom laundry area. It's fantastic. Another refrigerator, more cabinets, more subway tile backsplash, more granite, and lots more cabinets. Look, the golf clubs go here. The kids' hats and toys and family things go here. Another vacuum, and we'll show it from this view. And guess what's behind here? It's the laundry chute. We had one of these when we were little, and we used to play telephone and drop the paper and the string and the phone. Okay, so we're going to go on outside from this door and show off this gorgeous patio. And we're ready for you because we have some wine chilling. How perfect. It's a lovely night for that. And we'll head down the stairs. And look at this gorgeous lot. More slate patio. And as you can see, we'll walk down this way. Look at the beautiful knockout roses. Here's the back of the home where you can see that gorgeous line of windows. It's all hardy plank. There's the bay window to the left. That's off the dining room. And we're coming down the stairs along the beautiful hostas lining this walkway. And um, there's another patio in that door. Those doors take you into the family room downstairs. Then back up and around. It's a beautiful day too. The, it's in the 60s, partly cloudy. Are you ready to move in and write your offer? You 
you sure could. For more information, give us a call, 703-505-3898. Here's the peonies to the right, and look at the size of this driveway. It's got a basketball court, two-car garage, and we'll take you around to the front of the home after we show you a little bit more of the lot. So you can see this cedar shake roof is in very good condition and absolutely gorgeous. And they've got this semicircle drive that you come up and could hold a lot of cars for someone that wanted to host a, a big party. So the charm and the character just oozes from this home. It's a colonial, yet it could be called a cape, and yet it's um, got a very country feel and a very contemporary feel when you get to the kitchen. Isn't that stunning? You see all the nice big windows below. 100% privacy. show you a shot from the street and we'll come up the street and show you the um, the entrance so 10204 country view in Vienna It's a beauty. She's a beauty. And amazingly well maintained. So we're gonna come in the front door this time and we're gonna walk up the walk up the brick walkway. And come in and show you to the foyer once again. And then to the right into the dining room and back around to the kitchen. And I think this pretty much completes our tour, but we're gonna leave you with the, our favorite room in the house. Okay, thank you for watching.